Hello beautiful Taurus, how are you? Welcome back and welcome to all the Taurus that they are here today and uh, I really appreciate you for being here with me for today's reading. Uh, my name is Eric and today I'm going to pull the advice from the universe for you. This is going to be a general reading and if this reading resonates with you, please consider like, share and subscribe and do it now please. I appreciate you and then uh, and now let's see what's going on and what messages the universe has for you today and then you know we do work for our happiness and the best thing that the universe is the universe has a special message for you today and that special message is to do your part to keep the environment clean and do pass on a clean environment to the next generation. This is the message for the environment. And I'm sure you are going to be happy with what you are going to do uh, or what you are doing your part by doing recycle, by doing keeping your environment clean and doing your part. Because we are not waiting for some other people to do what they promise to do and that what we are paying them to do to do their part but uh, it's not enough uh, what is happening is not enough and the uh, planet uh, earth and uh, the modern environment is going and uh, doesn't is, is sick is not feeling good that's why we have to make it feel good and then do our part and then pass a better environment to our next generation like uh, we have to make the balance in our life and not helping ourselves helping the universe as well and feel responsible for that and then uh, some people say oh no my business I'm paying my taxes and then it's the, the government job and the city job and this and that and no no it's your job as well uh, every day I go for a walk I see a great uh, young couple they are running and then fit beautiful and uh, they have the gloves on and they have a plastic bag or a bag with them and then every, everywhere they see a trash and they pick it up put it in the bag at the end of the run they run for a couple of hours and then at the end of the run they go and put in the recycled bins or in the garbage bins i learn from them and I, every day when i see them i say hello to them and i say thank you very much i appreciate uh, from my sh uh, uh, part uh, for whatever you are doing and after the second day I learn from them and I'm doing it the same thing and lots of people in our neighborhood are surround us and everybody is coming to the park they are doing it the same thing you know how big it, the difference it makes if one thousands of the people living on the earth one thousand I'm not saying one hand one tenth one hundred uh, from a, how many billions of people living on this if one uh, thousands of those people take one piece of the trash every day or recycle one piece a day you know how many tons of extra tons of the trash would be removed from the oceans and from the next generation and we don't eat uh, plastic in the by eating the uh, er, anything like uh, the plastic goes to the soil and then we eat plants fruits yeah, it's in plastic. Uh, plat, uh, plat goes to the ocean, we eat fish, and the same thing. Plat uh, goes to the farms, and then uh, is micro uh, plastic that goes to the earth, uh, to the air, and we breathe it. It goes to our lungs. We, we cannot believe how dangerous is more than worse than atomic bomb is happening to the earth and then we don't do anything about it and then we should do our part don't leave it to the governments that they are talking and they use the uh, environmental money for the tanks and these kind of things that's don't worry about them and we worry about ourselves we worry about our responsibility what we need to do to move forward and that's but the big reward is coming to you i don't know what you did uh, recently that you made a big change in somebody's life and that is great and that message was sent to the universe and the universe is paying back to you big I don't know what the form is coming is the form of the love or in the form of the financial or a career or business is happening but it's happening seriously and it's happening uh, good for you be ready for that and then do whatever necessary changes that is happening is required 
to make that change because the, not beside the emotional thing uh, definitely a financial success is coming toward you but you should be ready for that the same thing as you when you go for shopping you get prepared you get your bags you prepare your bags uh, because they don't sell the plastic bags anymore <laughs> that's a good thing and then you make the list of the things that you want to do and then you go you want to buy and then you go buy grocery you want to go for a, a job interview you make your uh, yourself plus uh, presentable when you then to go to that proper interview when you go to interview for construction site you don't put the tie and jackets and suitcase and go to that i'm construction worker i i had construction business for 50 years that's why i know about that uh, the person who wants to go to uh, construction interview uh, goes with the boots and the uh, jeans and the hard hat and the, their hands doesn't look like a, uh, the hands of a person who works in the office if it looks at then they have no place in the construction and that is uh, the thing that that's why every job you present yourself but then how the, a big love and opportunity coming to you do you have to be organized and then do whatever is necessary look around if you need to make your goal and go for it and make the plan to achieve your goal and then change your plans based on the situation that comes from anything comes in the front just make it Make the changes, necessary changes. Don't be afraid of the ego. Ego, whatever you want to go, ego is telling you, no, you do remember last time what you tried and you had the financial disaster? Okay. Uh, okay, thank you very much, ego. Thank you for the reminder. But I'm not listening to you. I'm adventurous. I want to move forward. I want a success. I'm not happy with whatever I have. I want a better. I deserve better. That's why. You do your due diligence to make the things happen. That's why uh, you, you want to move forward, but you do, do your due diligence. And you, but you definitely deciding to move forward. Whatever you have is good. You appreciate that, but you don't. You are not happy. You, you, you want to move forward, and that is what your egos and what your uh, heart says and your. Uh, uh, God says and then you are getting ready all the signs is ready for moving forward it could be moving forward toward the love or it could be moving forward toward the uh, career but mostly I see that is all of them is love and career as well I see the happiness in the uh, union of the love I see the f uh, spiritual union I, that brings you the harmony and passion and choices and follow up your heart and mutual relationship is happening for you is could be in the form of the love or it could be in the form of the uh, union with a friend in the past that you had in the past or family members that coming toward you don't listen to the ego that is trying to tell you okay love don't forget about the love you know there is a back and forth always with the ego everybody has ego I have the ego, you have the ego, everybody has the ego. Don't listen to the ego that trying to stop you and just remind you the bad experience, the experiences uh, in the past. But you are smart and you learn from your experience and you get stronger and move forward. You don't let the bad experiences, all the signs here indicating the big opportunities coming for you this is could be the financial opportunity could be the love opportunity it could be any opportunity but the big opportunities is coming for you and these are the signs of the big opportunity that is coming for you believe it and then move forward it just don't let this pass by and uh, uh, you know i never win the lottery ticket you know why because i don't buy the lottery ticket <laughs> <laughs> uh, because I don't believe in the lottery ticket I make things happen for me that's why you don't buy a lottery ticket and I'm happy with whoever I am I'm, I'm not uh, focusing uh, my uh, mind is 
worth it more than I spend one month to buy the uh, or one week think about if I win the lottery ticket what is going to happen I make the things happen by making the goal and taking a small step and do whatever is necessary to reach my goal and that is who you are that is who you uh, a strong personality you have and you make the things happen by sending the message to universe asking help from the universe and we make it work out and you have great heart that's why all the good things happen to you when you are ready for it otherwise the opportunities comes and goes but don't let the opportunity slip from your fingers but the opportunity doesn't come all the time when you the, the energy level from with you and the universe is the same level it doesn't happen all the time it happens maybe once and then you you should be ready for it and take advantage take advantage for a happy healthy life in the future i see a great year for you i hope this uh, taurus uh, reading had resonated for you and some great messages for you if it does please consider like share and subscribe and then i see you in the next reading and please press the subscribe now and then uh, until then be happy healthy love yourself and love the others as well ciao